All right, it's December 29th, 2022. My name's Timothy French. We're in Chesney, South Carolina to continue on our quest to visit every town center in the state. So let's get started. We're right here to park on the edge of town in uh, the Over Mountain Victory National Horse Historic Trail runs through here. I didn't know that. And not too far off from here, about two miles, it's a battle of cow pens, another battle here in the area. Also near Kings Mountain, we already did that uh, trail around there we'll come back and do the cow pens uh, battlefield one day but we're not gonna do it today we're doing town centers today yeah Chesney was once a uh, home to the Cherokee Indians and had all these old growth forests and the buffalo roamed around here wolves mountain lions and bears and that's what they lived off of and then the Europeans finally moved into the area and set up shop here I reckon and they got this map here about this overland victory trail and i'm going to do that whole thing one day with you guys because i've been seeing it along a lot of trail uh, mount um along a lot of towns that we've been to you know like jonesville elkin up there in north carolina you can t see the tail trail comes down from two different directions one from abington abington up there in virginia and then they meet down in morganton and then they make their way on down uh the cow pens and then the, of course king's mountain that we talked about earlier Anyway, let's get started and walk through this town. See what they got to offer. First thing I noticed right across the street there, it says, a small town does not mean small dreams. That's for sure. There's a little park. I guess some guys must have walked right through here at one time or another on their way to create America, fight the British. I'm glad they did. <clears throat> So those railroad tracks out there wasn't always here but when the railroad came through it sure helped this town grow all right let's turn left head into the town center leave old rev down there at the park I hope nobody messes with her with him <laughs> okay i've got a whole line of looks like furniture out here you can buy maybe consignment i don't see a, a sign anywhere but they got it out here got some pictures bikes and things you can buy yeah, it looks like a thrift store consignment store of some sort it says faith home variety stores is a variety store all right across the way it says 201 west cherokee street got some bays there i don't know what that was Yeah, beautiful area for sure. Cherokee had a maid up in here for all those animals, buffalo, deer, and all that. Of course, it had to watch out for mountain lions and bears, I reckon. Man, I'd love to have seen it back in the day with all that old growth forest. Let's see. So, I'm not sure what street we're on. I'm looking. This is West Cherokee. Okay. Oh, that may be the fire department back there. That says municipal building. See police, they don't say fire though, so maybe the fire department somewhere else. That's some cool old buildings in town. We're passing the dentistry right now. Yeah, they got all this parking out here. So you won't have a, any trouble parking. You got homes fun. This is bluegrass gospels. So maybe that's a little church or something. I don't know. Got painted up where your create creativity is captured on canvas. So that's a nice thing to have in town coming here. Art studio. You got a credit central right there. That's a cool old building 121. I wonder what that was. Any of you locals know, let us know in the comments below. I like to hear about these places. I know a lot of times I've done, people have commented below and told me what the buildings were, and I do appreciate that. Got another mural here. Like a little door, <laughs> place to hang flags. Maybe there was a fence around it at one time. Make your mark. I love ice cream. I do too. <laughs> so that kid, he loves it. <laughs> Sailboat. Sun is shining around this ice cream, so I'm assuming I'm gonna go around the corner and find the ice cream shop. There's the other side as we come on out. Yeah, 
Coming soon, Eagle's Nest Coffee and Creamery. I hope so. I definitely hope so. That'd be nice. I hope they're in a business that went out of. Hope they didn't go out of business, but it says coming soon, so I'm assuming ice cream shop would be good, good here, I think. Mossberg Sign Products. Doesn't look like. No, it ain't open. Stuff all piled up at the door there. Here's a look at the other side as we go along. This town's bigger than I thought it was going to be, too. A lot of times I'll go to, I don't really look them up too much. I'll look at Wikipedia and their town site, but I try to just come in here not knowing what to expect so you can get my reaction to it. <clears throat> Got a lot of signs here on this fence. All right. There's a look out of town that way. There's the signs there. Cow pens. That's where I come in. Go back out that way to get the cow pens. Let's see if I can cross here. Yeah. I'm on 221 now. Take a ride to go to Camp Pabello. I don't know if I said that right. And then Gaffney back to the left. Sparkburg straight ahead. This is a drugstore, it looks like. Cash and Henderson drugs. So, oh, yeah, that's cool. That's cool. I'll tell you what we're going to do, we're going to cross over again <clears throat> here in a minute and we'll come back down this other side. Alright, let's do it. Yeah, Rutherford's back that way. We've been to Rutherford. 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 Rutherford turn. <laughs> I had trouble saying it the day I was there and I'm having trouble saying it now. Whew. Looks like a little uh, decor store there. We got a carpet place right here. Cash and Henderson drug stores right over there. I'm glad to see they're still open. <laughs> Police. Kind of chest. <laughs> you don't mean no business. What are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> Thought about using it for a thumbnail, but I don't know. We got a furniture store here. Looks like they're gonna do some uh, streetscaping. That's a good thing, but I'll tell you what, streetscaping is the number one thing that a town can do right off the bat to bring people in. I've seen that everywhere I've been, and that's what I like to see, and I'm sure other people. Hey, how you doing? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yep. They're working up there with the lots of furniture and flooring appliances. The bricks about to fall down, ain't they? <laughs> yeah, fixing them old buildings up, that's good. How you doing? Them old bricks getting old, ain't they? Y'all yeah. <laughs> fixing all these buildings up around here? Yeah, no, we off some last night. We tried to keep rolling the end of the door. Oh, okay. Well, good thing it didn't hit nobody, right? <laughs> oh, yeah. That's good. Keeping, keeping the building maintained. We got an old teddy bear. Looks like he didn't have an accident here. Somebody never run into him. Woo! Watson out with scratching in appliances here. <laughs> oh man, he lost his shoe. <laughs> well, as you can see, they need a little work around here. All right. Let's keep going. Door here is nothing in it. Their Christmas decorations have taken a hit. Man, this guy, deer then leg then got about broke off. <laughs> a lot of people in town though, laughing, talking. Looks like maybe that's a home relic store they're going in over there. Alright, Santa Claus is looking alright. Ho ho ho. Ho ho ho. Another building somebody can get right here is we're going out out of town. There's still some more buildings up here, so we're gonna keep going. Yeah, that got some presents there. Alright. They're working on the sidewalk. It's got these nice bricks in it. I like that. Harley Davidson Parts and Services services down there if you ride. I believe that's the post office back there. Yeah, I'm trying to see the street we're crossing. East Chester. I'm crossing East Chester. 
so much more is open. Yeah, go in there and check them out. The building could use a little paint though. The sun's right in my eyes right now. Southern guns and ammo. <laughs> He's open, ready to roll. Security finance. Yeah, these, like I say, they've worked on these sidewalks. And uh, they put out some nice decorations. Uh, you know, a couple of them up front had some damage, but I don't know. It's all right. Maybe, maybe take out this, this black wood chip, maybe, and just put some red stone or something. I think it'd look nicer. Coming soon, a brewing company. All right, that's a good sign. It's a good sign. Get them in your town, get some reason to come down and go shop to other stores while they're here. All right, there's Snoopy. <laughs> Snoopy sitting on his mailbox. I'll never forget when I was a kid, mom and dad took me to Kmart. I was young, I can't hardly remember it. And uh, dad was gonna buy me a little stuff. Snoopy. For Christmas, or, or something that I don't know if it's my birthday or Christmas. It seemed like it was Christmas though, but I don't know why they would have told me about it. So maybe my birthday. Anyway, there's a Hux Antique place right there, and a flower gallery right here on the end. But anyway, there was a big stuff Snoopy, Snoopy, and there was a little stuff Snoopy. And uh, he said I could get one. Well, I couldn't stand it. I, I told him I said, well, I hate to get one of them and leave the other one behind because he'll be lonely and i talked him in to get me both the small one and the big one <laughs> i'll never forget that yeah parents gave in to me thought that was sweet i reckon so they got a big old park they had decorated out here you can see businesses on the out but we're not going to go out any further that was, uh, we're just doing the town center but they got an old truck had it all lit up for the kids so that's nice but that's fun well, yeah, we all, we passed the Christmas now on the 29th. New Year's is right around the corner. 23 is coming. And I hope it was better than the previous years. <laughs> Let's hope. Keep your fingers crossed. All right. I'm going to do a walk back because i got to go that way anyway. Hope Rev's down there. And these bushes probably look good when they bloom out. I think they should try to plant some trees like this one. Maybe one that'll grow even bigger, kind of like uh, Forest City. They got enough room to take some of these parking spaces and plant some trees. That'd offer some shade and it looks nice and you can decorate them during Christmas. It's an interesting curved building here on the side. Huh. I, I like all the little things. They got presents, Santa Claus right there. This building still needs some work. Yeah, they, they definitely went out and did a new sidewalk, but even this looks kind of older now, so I don't know how long it's been like that. If you guys know, comment below. Tell me what's going on in this town. Western Auto's here. There's a look at the other side we were on earlier. And Mickey or Minnie Mouse right there. Communication store. Yeah, I think the rocks would do better because that blow, this black chips is, chips is flashing up on the white of the decoration. Got a lot of shop archery right here. Glad to see that in town. Yeah, come check them out when you're in town if you need your archery. Anything related to archery there. This was Twin State Auto, but it's nothing now. You got Jess Barber shop and hairstyle, so they'll do it both. I think this was Chester we said earlier. Let's walk on across. And back down there is that direction where the park was. Anderson Steel Supply. Hmm. I thought it was a garage. Steel Supply. I guess you can get metal stuff in there. It's a beautiful town. Need to work on the buildings like they were doing down there, making it safe for everybody. That's good to see. We've got a clothing start store, Har Harley's dress shop here. 
Didn't get a spa nail bar. There, oh. Got one new pole, a couple new poles. Let's see what they're trying to do here. Got some new black poles. I, don't know, I guess that's lights under them. Here at this photography shop. Home tail relics. Both in there, I think. Here's another building somebody could get. It says a law office, but this looks open, but they need to clean up that window a little bit right there. It looks bad. Alright. I don't know, maybe that's solar. Maybe that's solar for them lights. I don't know. They got a bank right here. Yeah. Maybe they took some trees out. Maybe that's what they did right there. So yeah. Get that cleaned up yeah I see a stump over there where we took some trees out uh, hope they're gonna put some trees back all right let's get on back down here by the Cassius drugstore I this toy soldier <laughs> I imagine they've been here a long time Yeah, you got that old drug tile you see at these old drug stores. I'm so glad to see that's open. Mm -hmm. Let's see what else I got going there. I got a nice little joy here. I like that. Let's get a picture of that. Yeah, that's cool. Get the sign out of it. Joy. Yeah, that's nice. Now, yeah, before I get run over, flowers and gifts right there. Book your event today, kid and play rentals. I guess they got like uh, those inflatables and stuff, maybe. Let's see. Maybe you can go in there and do a party, I guess. I got a bakery right here. It's open, that's good. People is out there getting them something. How you doing? How you doing? Doing good. Got a little store here. Uh, it's like a little. Mexican restaurant, maybe. Right. Well, I think we figured out what this building was down here that we didn't know. This ghost sign is going to tell it all. Chesney Hardware Supply Company. Now, it looks like a Pepsi. Pepsi sign. Look at the top of a Pepsi Coca-Cola top or something. Barely can see it, but this was probably the hardware store at one time. Yeah, closed now. So maybe somebody will come in here and put something cool here. A lot of opportunity in Chesney, I tell you what. Hope you enjoyed this walk and talk tour of Chesney, North Carolina. Not North, not North Carolina, <laughs> South Carolina. Yeah, I've been bouncing back and forth today. I did uh, Bowling Springs earlier, and that was in North Carolina. Now I'm just come down here in South Carolina and catch a couple down here. We're doing all the towns in both states. All right. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, I appreciate it. If you like, subscribe, and share. Y'all take care.